watts, and this time we're searching for the stars, but not the ones on Hollywood Boulevard. Today we're at Griffith Observatory, located on the southern slope of Mount Hollywood in Griffith Park, just above Las Feliz, California. It is 1,134 feet above sea level and is visible from many parts of Los Angeles. Its real purpose, however, is not to be seen. Rather, it enables visitors to see the stars and planets in our galaxy. Griffith Observatory is one of the premier public observatories in the world. One of the principal reasons is the presence and the regular availability of high quality telescopes. A telescope is an arrangement of lenses or mirrors or both that gathers light which allows you to see or photograph distant objects. Since opening in 1935, more than 7 million people have put an eye to the original 12-inch Zeiss refracting telescope at the observatory, which is intended mainly for nighttime viewing by the general public. You can target the moon, the planets, and the brightness showpieces of our galaxy. In fact, more people viewed Halley's Comet using the Zeiss than any other telescope on the planet. At the observatory, visitors can view rocket launches such as NASA's Delta II satellite rockets from Vandenberg Air Force Base, California, or the Hubble Space Telescope as it makes its occasional appearances while orbiting. Also from Griffith Observatory, visitors can get the bird's eye view of the greater Los Angeles area. Can you name the eight planets in our galaxy? They are Mercury, the planet closest to the Sun, Venus, the most visible from Earth, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Pluto was once considered the ninth planet after it was discovered in 1935, but a Hubble Space Telescope proved it was only a dwarf planet. NASA's New Horizon spacecraft is expected to arrive at Pluto in four years. That's all today from LA. Keep looking up at the stars.